Welcome to Upgrade. I'm your host, Frank the Tank. Today we're going to take a look at the Logitech Comfort MK570 keyboard and mouse. Now, this is not a Bluetooth. It's a USB thongle that you're going to require. Um, but we're going to take a look at some of the features on the actual mouse and the keyboard that what you can do. Uh, a lot of people like working from home these days. They want to make sure they're comfortable and have a, a, a place where they can put their palm. And this might be the object and the device for you. So we're going to take a look at it and see how well it works. So let's go ahead and take a look in depth. First of all, we're going to start with the mouse. The mouse itself, it has like a, a pleather uh, touch feeling right here. Two buttons in here. On this side, it's very comfortable, very small for hands. You know, if you guys can see it. Uh, this one comes with AA batteries, and this is where you actually store your USB. And if you, you can always store it here if you're going to travel with it. Your off and on button, your laser mouse. Um, so we're going to close this out. Uh, you have two buttons on the top, too, also. Um, changes. So people don't know about this button. Basically, if you're going to go down the, the pages, you just loosen it up, and it kind of doesn't click or anything. But if you push the button, it clicks little by little. So uh, no buttons on this side. Um, plastic still on. Uh, these get a lot dirty. They pick up a lot of dirt. Uh, if you attempt to eat at your desk or anything like that, you're gonna have to clean these up. And these are a little hard to clean. You need uh, uh, alcohol-free wipes in here. Alcohol wipes that to clean them out. It's much easier. Be careful not to spill any, any moisture on this area, all right? So keep away from that. On and off button, it's very simple. Now we're gonna take a look at the keyboard and mouse, the keyboard itself. Now, if you guys notice the keyboard here, this part, this is actually like a pleather too. It feels like more like the mouse too, but this is more for relaxing your palms in here. You could turn on your PC on and off if you have that feature on your computer and it's included on the Windows 10. They give you a feature if you wanna ever set up something like that. Um, they have zoom in, zoom in and zoom out for pages. So no longer the old ways of doing it was you hold on the control key and you screw up and, and scroll down and that's pretty much how you zoom. Now they include it in here. There's a zoom in, zoom out, multiple pages changes. Um, they have uh, settings in here. Uh, take a picture, screenshot. This is pretty much a screenshot. Your audio uh, is all included here. So if you have a media center, you pretty much, this is the older version of Microsoft Media Center. They pretty got rid of it, but they still hold on the button because they still include the Media Center that's included on Windows 10. Audio music, so you can program this to actually open your iTunes and stuff like that. You can mute the system, volume up, volume down, and then forward and back, back, and then a play and pause. Of course, this is one of the most important buttons for your accountants out there. This is your calculator button. This is a plus right now. So the it's our ergonomical keyboard. Um, we're gonna test it out and we're gonna see how well it works. So let's do a sound test first. All right, here's the sound effect of the keyboard. It's pretty loud keyboard. So I like the 10 key feature. I do like that. That's a plus on a lot of features that are missing. I like the ergonomical um, smoothness of it. Um, nice feel. Uh, not that many fancy features. There are a lot of outdated features that are no longer work with Windows 10, but it does the job. So other than that, if you guys like stuff like this, let me know. I'm your host, Frank the Tank, and we are out.